Today I'm going to do a video showing you how to make the butterfly out of fantasy film on this card here. You will need some baking paper or grease proof paper for this project, some scissors, the heart winged butterfly stamp from Hero Arts, some fantasy film from Art Glitter or some heat bondable iridescent glitter film from Creative Expressions, a craft iron and some stays on. I cut the fantasy film into four pieces large enough to fit over the top of my stamp. Here I've decided to use two different colours for each set of butterfly wings. I then take the stays on ink and generously cover it over the stamp. I then place the fantasy film carefully on top. You can use between two and four layers of fantasy film on this technique. Obviously the more layers you use the stronger the butterfly will be. I'm just using two here today. I've then placed the grease proof baking paper over the top of the fantasy film. This stops it from sticking to the bottom of the iron. I then have the iron on a medium heat and I gently rub over the image with the iron. This causes the actual film underneath to fuse together and it doesn't damage rubber stamps but please don't use it on a clear stamp because it will ruin your clear stamps. Once I have ironed over it you can actually see the butterfly image showing through where it is fused together. I then remove the film from the stamp and we have our butterfly image on the paper. I then cut round my image so that it is ready to use on my card. I create two butterflies using this technique. When you have finished cutting out your butterflies, don't throw away your scraps because they can be ironed together and you can use them in a die cutting machine to make things like these seahorses, which I then used on this card here. Your butterflies are now ready to be assembled and all you need is some high tack, all purpose PVA sticky glue and I just put that down the centre of the body of my butterfly. and then just stick them together. Once this is dry you can then decorate your butterfly with um, your ink essentials pen to achieve the dotted effect. You can put some little wire antennae on the butterfly just to finish it off and then adhere it to your card. There are some variations to this. I have made a butterfly here using another Hero Arts stamp and done a beaded body and I've actually mounted it onto a brooch pin so that you can give it as a gift on your card. You're not limited to butterflies either. Here's another Hero Arts stamp that I used, the, heart, the Flourish Flower. And on this one, I've used two different colours of fantasy film and cut it out to give it a bit more dimension. Thank you for watching.